you have an entire chapter <laughs> devoted to <laughs> is chapter four is called cuckoo soup now for the cuckoo uninitiated soup. please explain uh what cuckoo soup is uh, cuckoo soup is basically a love potion oh okay <laughs> you make you make a soup and then you add some special ingredients Okay, we ain't talking about, you know, cumarin, cumin, turmeric, or whatever. What kind of special ingredients are you talking about? Well, the best ingredient would probably be a a, a panty that's been worn for about three weeks. Wow. <laughs> yeah. And replete with uh, preferably menstrual blood, is that? If it has any fluid of any kind, mm -hmm. that's, that's the ingredient that's going to get that man to stay with you. Wow. And you, you, this is done with the soup, mm -hmm. and then you, you feed it to them. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Well, it's definitely and a character in the book. Uh, <laughs> you have a chapter devoted to it, and you see that the, the introduction of this particular soup, um, how, and particularly the time <laughs> at which he is fed yes. the soup, uh, and you see the ramifications going forward. And it's interesting because um, uh, quite a few cultures have this, uh, um, uh, um, I guess, thing if you will um this idea that yes you that you, power. you yes, yes it's it's power mm -hmm. and it keeps your man from straying uh yeah i believe yeah. that that is the 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 story behind uh putinesca sauce uh mm -hmm. oh. pasta sauce Ooh. uh red Ooh. pasta sauce <laughs> i'm just gonna oh. leave it there you know when your man oh. goes to see uh, I'll never look at it the same again. <laughs> <laughs> I know. It's like, oh, what's the sauce? But oh, I'm good. Thank you. I'm sure as we have evolved, uh, uh, yeah. I'm sure that we we tend to stick but, to ingredients in the spice cabinet as opposed to. Uh, yeah. Mm. Yeah. But it's still being used. I'm sure in different places it's still being used because people tend to. When you get desperate, you will do anything. Oh, right, right. Mm. And I think sometimes women feel they have to be desperate. Even though we're so strong and we support each other, mm. there are just times when they get desperate. Yeah. Right, and, and I, I mean, I, I, don't, I don't give Annie any brief. Um, she is definitely... <laughs> Uh, where where people say, well, I can see something in this character that, no, I, I found that if I were to feel sympathetic toward her, I could see mm -hmm. that she was so in love with Julius and she mm -hmm. thought that she would be the chosen one. And, yeah. uh, you know, having grown up in Nassau and gone to the family islands as a child, uh, look at this yeah. Nassau gal, come up in here and take my man. You know, exactly. So, yeah, so... She exactly. she took her power, but boy, what a okay. power! Ooh. Yeah, yeah, power, power, corrupting power of the supernatural, and to but you can, but you can, you can. I find that some people actually, I've talked to people who say they use spells, but really? you know, I think Annie got corrupted by her 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 greed. Yes, and she got corrupted by her love. Yeah, and her mom. Yeah. I mean, her mom was I no mom. roadmap. Her mom was no. was like, you know, this is the way. This is what we do, and and pretty much get in line, mm -hmm. give the yeah. man the soup. Mm -hmm. But yeah. <laughs> she, because of her uh, zeal, her exuberance, and her impatience, uh, mm -hmm. and I think you handle this well. That uh, she, her recipe. <laughs> <laughs> had some flaws and uh, yes. if if yes. if you want to find out you just have to read the book okay